we join together in the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Let us pray for the whole people of God and for all people according to their needs. Dearest Heavenly Father, we thank you for the great reunion when your Son came in the flesh and reunited the world with him. Lord, we pray that he will quickly come again, that we might have the even greater reunion that comes when the, the bridegroom brings his bride at last to rest in the bridal hall when we celebrate the great marriage feast. Lord, this Christmas, as we go out into the world of sorrow, let us bear the seed of Jesus coming, the joy and the hope and certainty that were given at that first nativity, the joy and the hope and certainty that come when people hear the word of Christ, when they receive the sacraments of our Lord. Let us be those who bless others with the songs and the lights and the love. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, we pray that the leaders of our nation might be those who sow things which produce life rather than those who continue to dwell in the sadness and darkness. The seed of life that they produce, Lord, is good laws and, and good execution of those laws. Lord, give them wisdom to do so, so that peace and prosperity might reign. And at Christmas, Lord, let them free the church to celebrate, to show the world the joy that is the coming of Jesus, so that they can hear our shouts of joy and know the reality of the greatness that happened. Lord, we pray for our soldiers that they might return home and reunite with their families that they might have joyous times, times which are like a dream together. We pray for our policemen, that they can go forth bringing seeds of law and order into communities full of the chaos and death. And Lord, that those communities might come out better and the policemen might return safely. Be with our emergency workers and our farmers, our parents, our teachers, our doctors, our nurses. Be with all those who combat COVID-19, and, and those who are experiencing it. Lord, have the vaccines which have been created be effective and useful in, in terminating the darkness caused by these germs so we can have more times which are like dreams. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, we look to those in our congregation who are being separated off by sin and death and by the weakness of their bodies. Lord, let them know they are not separate, that you are always with them. And give them people in their family and in their church community who reconnect them with you and reconnect them with life. Lord, in particular, we pray that you give healing to Irma and Joe, Dick, Margie, Gary, Marcel, Lois, Wayne, Rodney, and we thank you that Francis and Amy have come through their COVID crisis. Lord, also be with Helen and Rick, John, Bev, Eli, Bev, Herman, Marie, Elaine, and Harold. Lord, continue to give them strength and, and let them heal 
and return to normal life. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Into your hands, O Lord, we commend all for whom we pray, trusting in your mercy through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And we sing together our hymn of praise, hymn 349, Hark the Glad Sound. Hark the glad sound, the Savior comes, the Savior promised long. Let every heart prepare a throne, and every voice a song. He comes, the prisoners to release, in Satan's bondage held. The gates of brass before him burst, the iron fetters yield. He comes the broken heart to bind, the bleeding soul to cure. And with the treasures of his grace, to enrich the humble poor. Our glad hosannas, Prince of Peace, thy welcome shall proclaim. And hands eternal arches ring with thy beloved name. We join together in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord look upon you with his favor and give you peace. Amen. We close with hymn 337, The Night Will Soon Be Ending. The night will soon be ending, the dawn cannot be far. Let songs of praise ascending, now greet the morning star. All you whom darkness frightens with guilt or grief or pain, God's radiant star now brightens and bids you sing again. The one whom angels tended comes near our child to serve. Thus God, the judge offended, bears all our sins deserve. The guilty need not cower, for God has reconciled. Through his redemptive power, all those who trust this child. The earth in sure rotation will soon bring morning bright. So run where God's salvation glows in a stable's light. As old as sin's perversion is mercy's vast design. God brings a new creation, this child did seal and sign. Yet nights will bring their sadness and rob our hearts of peace. And sin in all its madness around us may increase. 
But now one star is beaming, whose rays have pierced the night. God comes for our redeeming from sin's oppressive might. God dwells with us in darkness and makes the night as day. Yet we resist the brightness and turn from God away. But grace does not forsake us, however far we run. God claims us still as children through Mary's infant son. May today be like a dream in the peace of the Lord, and may you go forth seeding in sorrow but reaping in joy. Amen. <laughs>